Farnsworth Group Incorporated was the prime consultant for the South Fort Collins Sanitation District New Headworks and the dewatering facilities located in Fort Collins, Colorado. The South Fort Collins Sanitation District needed an upgrade to the performance and capacity of their existing water treatment plant headworks and sludge dewatering facility. The district turned to the Farnsworth Group Incorporated team to develop a quality solution for both. At the inception of this project, um, we sat down with South Fort Collins Sanitation District and our engineering group at, at Farnsworth and collaborated in a brainstorming session to talk about the project's objectives. This project was somewhat unique in that we really wanted to look at it for a long-term facility, not just your typical 20, 30 year design life, which you might hear, but take this facility well into the future. It was important to the district that all screening and grit removal be performed prior to pumping the influent sewerage to the aeration basin. This drove the bottom of the headworks facility to nearly 45 feet in depth. Due to high groundwater tables, expansive soils, and a very tight site, a special pier foundation was created, extending the bottom of the drilled piers 30 feet below the bottom of the structure, or 75 feet below ground level. The project itself was a fairly complex project. It was a, from a technical standpoint, the engineering aspects of it were pretty unique. It was a very deep structure from the existing grade down to the bottom, so there was a large excavation. There were some challenges that had to be addressed from a groundwater uh, standpoint and structural stability of the facility. So we developed some, some unique um, systems that would allow the staff prior to entering the facility to turn on um, ventilation systems rather than them running continually so that they could actually turn them on and there was a series of red and red and green lights, if you will, that would tell them when they could and when they couldn't go into the facility. Mechanical and ventilation systems were designed to provide the most efficient ventilation to meet codes, with hydronic heat used in explosive areas to mitigate the safety classification requirements. Full automation, backup power, and SCADA systems are provided in the state-of-the-art, high-performance and reliable facility, and the district has achieved the highest level of performance with its new equipment.